Ever since I installed a Raspberry Pi on the side of my 3D printer to use Octoprint, the humming noise from the fan of the Raspberry Pi felt somewhat loud. Since I was planning to keep the Raspberry Pi on 24-7, I thought it was worth a shot to try and reduce the fan noise. This is the pinout for a Raspberry Pi 4B. Originally, the fan was connected to pins 4 and 6, 5 volt and ground. I wanted to change the power source for the fan to 3.3 volts in order to quiet it down. So the potential pins were pin number 1 and pin number 17. I searched the Raspberry Pi forum and there were conflicting opinions about powering a 5 volt cooling fan with the 3.3 volt pins. Some warned that the 3.3 volt pins are not designed to draw so much power and may cause permanent damage to the board if you try to power a fan with the 3.3 volt pins. And you should use re a resistor or a voltage regulator to slow down your fan. However, a handful of people seem to be using the 3.3 volt pins for powering a fan without issues. I wanted to take the risk and try this idea out. After all, the best way to learn is to put some money on it, right? However, I had a problem. This is what my fan looks like. The female pins are attached to a single housing with the two pins side by side. This means that this fan can only be connected to two adjacent pins, like pin 4 and 6. In order to connect pins 1 and 6, I had to find a way to separate the pins. Luckily, I have bought a DuPont connector DIY kit a few days ago, so I was able to tackle this issue. The kit has male and female pins and different types of housings, and you can basically make any type of connection you want. My plan was to swap this red casing and change it into two of these single ones. First, pull out the connector for the fan. Then, with something sharp, push the latch back by pressing the opening in the casing. This makes the pins inside latch off and you can easily remove the casing. I took two single casings from the DuPont Connector DIY kit. The side with an opening of the casing and the side where you can see the crimped wires of the pin should line up. Gently push it in until the pin is totally inside the housing. The second housing was stiffer than the first one, so I needed to push it further in with a pair of pliers. Now connect the red wire to pin number 1, 3.3 volts, and the black wire to pin number 6, ground. Time to test how it works. Powering up the Raspberry Pi and checking if the fan is working properly. I already noticed that the fan was much quieter than before. After assembling the case, I tested the noise level. Twenty three decibels, not bad. At this point, I wanted to make a side by side comparison when powering the fan to five volt and three point three volts. 
I know that it's risky to plug and unplug stuff on the fly, but I did this in the name of science. First, when I connected to 5 volts, the noise is 36 decibels. And 3.3 volt is 27 decibels. The readings are higher than before because the lid is directly exposed to the mic. Well, that's all for this video. This is my first experience with a Raspberry Pi and I'm still on the beginning of the learning curve. Please let me know if you have had any experience with the fan noise of your Raspberry Pi and I'd love to get some advice. Thanks for watching.